Bangarang Rufio. What's up, everybody? Welcome back to Lost Boys Gaming. It's been a while, but we are back at it, and we got another gym badge battle for you guys. We are continuing the Johto region in our fourth gym badge for the Fog Badge. So make sure you hit that subscribe button and like the video so you are kept up to date with everything going on here at Lost Boys Gaming. As you hopefully know, as we're going through every single gym badge in the Pokemon universe before we get to Gen 9 and Scarlet and Violet. So I really appreciate you guys for watching and, and hitting that subscribe button like the video. So today, as I mentioned, we are taking on, I think Morty's his name for the Fog Badge. Um, our team is getting a little bit more fledged. Uh, what's the word I'm trying to think of now? Whatever. Filled out. Um, we got a Croconaw. A uh, Stantler, a Flaffy, and a Sudowoodo currently. Um, we didn't really need much of anybody else outside of uh, Tesla, the Flaffy, and our Croconaw, Darth Maul. Uh, Darth Maul. Um, so yeah, it was a pretty, this one's pretty easy. Dark, um, being super effective against Ghost, made Darth Maul very helpful for us as we could hit uh, that bite, you know. Made it a lot easier than uh, it would have been otherwise. And then Flappy having that access to uh, Thunder, I think it was the new just Thunderbolt, but it really did help as that lightning attack is pretty good. So we'll have to wait and see though, see what Nintendo does. So I think we're gonna get a announcement here in the next couple of days, I would think, um, or the next couple of weeks maybe even, if it's that long for some new information on Scarlet and Violet. Um, yeah, it's going to be interesting to see what they do. I think we can get some new Pokemon that we still can get revealed. I think maybe they go with another gym battle or two, but we are getting closer and closer, you know, just, just a couple more weeks, really. Um, I think it's like 50 some odd days left is all. So it's getting, it's getting down there, the leaks and the um, stuff like that is going to be definitely starting to come up here more and more. So if you want to avoid those, you're going to make sure that you've you did certain words things that will we'll cover some stuff but probably not anything too groundbreaking um is we haven't really covered anything in a while as far as leaks goes is there's been so much of it and it's been a little bit too much in my opinion especially for just for how early it was so uh but as we get closer to the game actually releasing i expect to see some actual more screenshots you know we've gotten a couple of things here and there but i think we'll see some some more clear images, more screenshots, people actually finding the game out in, in stores or in the wild or whatever. Um, so it's gonna you're gonna be wanting to avoid those, especially for some story some story stuff I would think. We'll probably get some of those out here in probably the next couple of weeks as well. So I think that Nintendo or Pokemon company could really get out ahead of it if they give us some more information soon. Um, I don't want them to give us too much though, I guess. Because that kind of defeats the point, and a lot of people complained about how um, Sun and Moon were released. There was a lot of stuff uh, that was just shown off, and pretty much knew the whole game before the game actually came out, and uh, and that was just stuff from the from the Pokemon Company rather than even from just like leakers. So we'll have to kind of just see what happens. But if you don't want to uh, be spoiled going to be a lot of a lot of those floating around here in the next couple of weeks as we get closer and closer to that November 18th release date but yeah I know I'm, I'm very excited to see what what they have in store I think that, that these are going to be fun I know that depending on some of the leaks and stuff that have already come out that um, you may or may not be as excited as you were uh, but I, I am very excited still I think this is going to be some fun stuff so there it is we claimed our fog badge from morty so i uh, hope you guys enjoyed this make sure you hit that subscribe button like the video let me know down in the comments what you guys are most looking forward to from scarlet and violet uh what's your been your favorite gym battle so far or what's your favorite gym battle in the series uh, is a whole one we'll eventually we're gonna get there in the next 50 some odd days we've just got some some more gym battles we gotta do we gotta get through all of them so Hope you guys enjoyed, and until next time, catch you later.